Today on the channel, we're taking a look at Cat Luigi with Super Bell from Jack Pacific Super Mario line. Really happy to get this guy. I was able to get him from Walmart last week. You know, so I was on the lookout for the the cat versions of the characters, like the Cat Mario, the Cat Luigi. I did pass on the Cat Princess just because I don't pick up any of the Princess uh, Peach figures. Don't care for the character. Um, yeah, this guy looks really cute. Really happy to see him on the shelf there. I guess they're just, yeah, getting re-released whenever, like, who knows. I think these newer versions of the figures, like these newer releases, have more articulation. I'm not really sure, but I do think these, like, newer releases have more articul articulation. I'm not positive, but... Like, maybe this original release never had movement in the knees? I'm not really sure, but I don't know. Let's take a look. Well, the figure looks amazing inside the packaging here. I almost don't want to take them out. This looks so pretty with this blue and all the colors. It's a very nice looking uh, figure inside the packaging. The packaging is great on these. You got the other characters that come in this wave. I also picked up Boom Boom from this wave. Yeah, I got Lammy, Koopa Troopa. I don't know. I don't think I have him already. Another Mario. It's nice that they're like releasing these again and again and again because if you missed out, then you get another chance. So that's really nice. So he comes with a Super Bell accessory. I really like these little accessories that the Nintendo um, figures come with. The little power... Um, uh, what are they like? Yeah, the little power-ups and stuff. I really like them. I almost wouldn't mind like a, a package of just like those little things, like of uh, the little power-ups, the little leaves and flowers and stuff. So like right off the hop, he looks really good. He's really cute. All the cat uh, characters are really cute, like Mario and I guess that's it. <laughs> um, yeah, his paint's really good. He's got like a little bit of... Uh, a little bit off paint there, but it's got a different color green here with this light green. It's definitely like a Luigi color, colored green. This is a different color. It's got this code written on his tail. It's too bad they didn't print that on the, 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 the back of the tail. But then he's got like a white butt, which I guess... <sighs> And he's got his little white paws and white gloves. And he's got like little extra things like these little pink things, little paw pads on his feet. And then he's got the little pink here. And then he's got a little, actually like two different kinds of pink in his ear. And his awesome looking blue eyes here with his mustache. So... The paint's really nice on this figure. Looks really good. Uh, lots of like head articulation. Not only does it like go side to side, but it also goes, you know, up and down a lot. The shoulders move nicely. Um, you got the, the elbows, the wrists move, nothing in the torso. The tail goes up and down and moves from side to side. You got movement in the hips. You got the, the knees and the foot. And it's like so close together, all this movement. So he's got tons of movement for such a tiny little figure too. Wow. Not that I'll be putting him in any like crazy poses, I don't assume. Like maybe like in some sort of, I don't know. Can you put him on? Oh, no, you can't put him in like a cat crawling. His legs don't go up. Oh, so there's that. <laughs> I guess technically you could have him like this. I might kind of put his head up, but no, I guess he's meant to be pretty much be standing straight up. I guess I'll be on the lookout for the, the Mario that comes in the cat suit to go with this guy. That's on the menu at the moment I guess if I see that Mario that would be great 
I assume it should be coming sooner or later. I don't know. I don't know what's going on with the releases with these Nintendo figures, but they don't seem to be very uh, tough to find. They seem to be just coming out again and again and again, which is great. And um, it's basically the only figures I can like collect in person. Like they're the only things that's actually at like my stores. So everything else I have to get just pretty much strictly from Amazon and online. But so it's nice to when you go to the store and you can actually find something like you know on the pegs. So yeah, so this is a great looking Luigi. He goes great with you know the other Luigis and the other Nintendo figures. Well, that's it for today's review. If you're not subscribed, please consider subscribing to the channel and I'll catch you next time. Thanks. Bye.